and we have this dude, this dude is trifling as hell, trifling. So this dude worked at the bank and he stole $88,000 from the bank vault. Now, you know, going into the bank, they got cameras everywhere. Like, why did he think that he was not going to get caught on top of that? He's posting and snitching on himself on social media, but let's go ahead and roll this short clip. the feds end up getting him for what he was doing. Now the feds had reported from the U S attorney's office in the Western district of North Carolina. Cause this story actually came out of Charlotte. It said that he went to his social media page and had a life of luxury that he was funding. So they said that the 29 year old was arrested. He stole out of the bank vault about 18 times this year, 18 times. It wasn't a one time thing. So they said throughout July and August of this year, he went to social media to account several pictures of him holding large stacks of cash. Then he committed loan fraud in connection of him getting a luxury automobile. So he had made a $20,000 down payment on a brand spanking new Mercedes that he had money he stole from the bank vault. Then on numerous of occasions, they were depicting him with lots of cash. He falsified bank documents to obtain a car loan from another financial institution to cover the remaining balance of the vehicle. Because obviously he, he only got so far one that he lied to get that from another bank. Then it showed him posing with a white Mercedes Benz in Hollywood, California. He was arrested on December the 4th. Now they said, according to the indictment contained in the release, he took bank customers cash deposits out of the bank for months. And many of those times that he took the money, he deposited in the ATM where he worked according to release. He said he made it look easy, but this is really a process of something he actually wrote on Facebook. Like what I don't understand about y'all modern day criminals. I'm gonna say that much. I've never seen so much self snitching. I've never seen it. It, it, it. It's like you stealing money from the bank. Why do you think you're not going to get caught for one? Then you're going to go on social media and you're going to be flashing all this cash. Go and try to get a Mercedes Benz. Man, anytime you have any kind of money as a black person, them folks going to be looking at you. That's why you got to dot your I's and cross your T's when you get the money even the right way because of how they looking at you due to the country that we live in. Then you sitting up here, you guys will record a fight. You go start a fight. You have your friend to record it and it shows you starting the fight and you initiating the first punch. So all the prosecutor got to do is look at the tape, see you throw the first punch and whatever that person did for you to against you back, they're going to say self defense because Hey, y'all recorded it. You upload it to Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, you upload it everywhere. It's like y'all make a prosecutor's job extremely easy. They ain't got to go look for nothing no more. I, I never seen a culture of self snitching, never seen it. Now he was destroying documents. He created false documents to keep people off his tail. But when they ended up getting him, he was charged 19 counts of theft embezzlement and misapplication along with 12 counts of making false entries and two counts of financial institution fraud. Now those crimes carry a maximum of 30 years in prison and a $1 million fine. He also was charged with transactional money laundering, which carries a penalty of 10 years behind bars and a $250,000 fine. So he had appeared in the U S district court in Southern California earlier this month, according to the release, 
with a case said to be tried in North Carolina by a U.S. attorney's office in Charlotte. So you did all that for, for, for social media cloud as well, because when y'all go here and y'all posting money, you are doing that for cloud off of social media. And all you looking for is for likes. You're looking for views. Look, I'm gonna tell you, I've gotten millions of views on YouTube and I didn't have to go show no money. I didn't have to go show no cars. I just put up content. That's it. One of my biggest videos I've ever made have over 10 million views on it on my main channel. Okay. It's just views. You doing all this crap, $88,000, but then people that you're doing it for, they're not going to do that time for you. You go sit in there and do that time. And that's fair time. And that's white collar crime. That's what he, he done, but it's still fair time. So the next one is going to sit up there and steal from something, a bank or whatever. And you being so stupid to tell on yourself. In my opinion, you deserve every bit of that they're going to give you because you stupid enough to self snitch. I just don't understand y'all. Y'all love to self snitch. I don't get it, but leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this dude snitch on himself. You know, stealing the money from the bank. And this is the thing you stealing people's hard earned money. And a lot of times people come to banks with, let's say at the end of the day, you know, you have a business, you make your deposits at the bank. That's what a lot of times what cash come from with a lot of people. I mean, major amounts of cash. It could be somebody's payroll, how they pay their employees. You know, it could be whatever it may be, but you out here instead of you working hard and getting it yourself because you can work hard out here and, and, and get that same money, that same Mercedes Benz. Mercedes Benz ain't nothing to get. Is that what you want? And man, they got Mercedes Benz right now. If you want a, a real good, decent used one. And even, I think even brand spanking new, you can get something that's like over 30,000. Is that what you want right here in Houston? It'll be the smaller Mercedes Benz, but Hey, if you're that kind of person that's all on brands, it don't matter. You know, you, you get your little, little, you know, uh, thoughts if that's what you want, you know, try to impress them with Mercedes Benz. You like that type, but you know, it's so stupid. They just did a, God, this guy's stupid.